Hi, this is Adamus DM, and today I'm going to show you how to paint spider miniatures from Whiskits. First, to make sure that I'll be able to paint them from all the sides, I put the spiders on sticks and glue them. To start off the paint job, I use dark grey as my base layer. I don't use a fancy brush, because in this project it's not crucial to have something very fancy. Yeah. When it's all dried up, I use dark brown wash to make a layer over the base paint. Most of this wash will be covered, but some of it will remain visible and it will make a nice effect afterwards. At least I hope so. Next up, I mix up a dark brown that I like. I use a little bit of base brown and I darken it up a little with dark grey. Now I use the same brush to make a base coat of this dark brown, but I make sure not to paint those little leg points. I, I would call them spider knees or like rivets. Uh, yeah, let's call them spider knees. I put a base coat of this brown all over the spider except the spider knees. Then I take a lighter tone, in this case a flesh tone, and dry brush all over the spider. I spotted some excess around the fangs and wanted to get rid of it at this stage, so so I take a knife and just try to get rid of it. Now I'm going to need a desaturated yellow for the rivets, or the spider knees. I tried to make a desaturated yellow using yellow, white and black, but it didn't work out too well and I had to scrap that. Now I'm using yellow and just a little bit of light grey primer. This gives me the desaturated color that I wanted. I paint this desaturated yellow all over the spider knees. Now I take a dark wash it could be black, it could be dark brown, and put it only on the furthest back part of the main body of the spider. You could say I put it all over the butt of the spider. Here I will use a little bit of a finer brush to give the spider some details. I'm gonna give it green venom fangs and red dots as eyes.
Now I take red wash. I put it all over the body except the furthest back part that I already washed with a dark wash. Now I use a little bit of matte medium for the body and the spider knees and some gloss medium for the leg segments in between the knees, for eyes and the fangs. And here's the final product. If you found this video helpful or useful, tell me down in the comments. Thank you very much for watching, see you next time.